Okay, this is uh, this is my little network, um, and I've run a three-minute test, and you can see here that I have my oh goodness. There you go. So uh, my delay gets quite high, almost up to. Uh, it looks like it could get higher, but it's only a three-minute test. So let's just say my delay is getting to 0 0.60, right? Now that is 600 milliseconds, right? If it got to one, that would be 1,000 uh, milliseconds, and that's one second of delay. And we, we don't want that, right? But if you can make enough background traffic, uh, you can get to one second of delay. And when you implement QoS, uh, that one second of delay will be like cut almost in half so you'll have a really good um, thing to, to look at if you have at least one second of delay but uh, okay so this is my uh, network at the moment so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna save this one so I go scenarios uh, duplicate scenario this is gonna be show and tell QoS1 QoS1 okay all right let's zoom me out again okay so um, I'm just going to show you guys my profile. So we were getting a, a few errors and I've realized that if you leave the start time to 100 and then just increase the time you use the uh, you spend on the simulation, uh, the network should kick out less errors. So that's always nice. But um, all right, so let's go. Protocols, IP, QoS, configure QoS. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to choose FIFU, which is first in, first out, on all connected interfaces. Click OK. All right, beautiful. So look, everything has got like some sort of crazy color to it now. And uh, and then we shall run QoS. And now, if this is the first time you've impl you've chosen QoS, this little thing will pop up. Um, and this is the QoS parameters. And uh, if you open it, you can see all the different things here. These are all the different QoS's you can have. FIFU profiles. If you open FIFU, we open FIFU again. Uh, and it just tells you all the details about FIFU. This is the, the queue size. So if you increase the queue size, more and more packets will, will come. And then they'll get stuck in the queue uh, over here, waiting to get into the into the server. And so that's what the queue size is for that. But... Um, I didn't run any tests like that. What I did is um, I'll compare the two here so you can see what FIFU looks like uh, compared to the normal traffic. All right, beautiful. So let's go current projects. So we're seeing all the projects now. Uh, I've got a lot of projects here, so I'm going to go show and tell and show and tell QoS1. Okay, so, boom, boom, actually let's just do one of these, boom. Okay, so you can see this is what it looks like, let's make it a little bigger, oh, 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 okay. So the red one is sh uh, show and tell, right, and that's absolutely, is that just, the, so that is all my background traffic. And all my that's my gamer traffic, sorry, and uh, it's got background traffic making it uh, have a high delay, and then you'll notice here uh, the blue one is the QoS, so that is FIFU. So first in, first out is a, a protocol. I'm going to say protocol, but don't quote me. Uh, that um, is very fair because the first packet that gets to the router uh, gets processed first and then sent out. Uh, so you can see how the traffic looks different just because it has FIFU and you can tell that it's not kicked up the same uh, level of height. So we've decreased the delay from, let's just say, 0 0.60 to uh, 0 0.45, right? That's really cool. It's like a, what, I don't know, I mean, 15 second delay or something. And now, so that's beautiful. But now what we're going to do is we're going to try another one. So let's save. And then let's go scenario, duplicate scenario, this is going to be QoS2. All right, now we're going to do something cool. So uh, let's implement another one. This one's going to have different stuff. So 
Fifu only had one profile over here, but we're gonna do pro to queuing, right? Uh, that's the abbreviation is PQ. And here you got different profiles. So you can have protocol based, port based. Uh, this stands for differentiation services, something point based. Uh, so we're gonna do terms, TOS based, that's terms of service based. We have a K. All right, now you're gonna need this little thing. Now remember, it magically appears when you enable Q, uh, QoS. So uh, you go here, edit attributes, and what you'll see here is I am doing priority queuing. So it says priority queuing profiles, open that. Uh, I'm doing terms of service based uh, profiling, so open that. Uh, open up details. Now these are the different classes. Now if we give our um, game traffic a high class, it will then go through uh, at any queues, it'll go through uh, faster. So let's open up high, uh, it says here, uh, classification scheme, ugh, classification scheme. Uh, let's just make this a little bigger. Uh, all right, number of rows, let's see here. So uh, reserved seven, all right, let's open that boy up. All right, so here it's showing us that uh, Number seven, which is the highest number you can get, like the highest level of uh, uh, of classification that you can give your um, uh, application, is seven. And so, if I so if I've opened this now, and it says terms of service. If I have it on the terms of service profile, which I do, uh, it's going to have uh, the highest one is reserve seven. So we know that that's all cool. So now we're going to go to our application. And we're going to make sure our application is running. So this is game, uh, description, uh, database, edit. All right, so type of service, best effort, zero, right? Everything is running at zero. My spam traffic, my background traffic, uh, my currently my application. But this is what we're going to change. So if we click over here on best effort, we can choose... Uh, zero to seven right now we know that seven is the highest one we can get on priority queuing um, so let's choose seven and then we hit OK now our traffic is in class seven right instead of class zero which means it's going to get priority when it gets to any of the routers because um, the routers is where all this uh, calculations happen I believe but I've got a router on every single point. So the traffic's going to come from these computers, hit the switch, from here, hit the switch. It's then going to get here. And then this router is going to say, all right, are you priority? No? Okay, wait in the queue. All the, ga all the games over here that are priority are going to go straight through. Well, as this guy who's running background traffic, he's going to have to wait. All right? So that's all going to happen. So if you run another test, I should have probably ran a test while we were talking. Okay. So all the traffic over here is coming to this router. So effectively, my all my network traffic gets filtered here. And then I believe it gets filtered again here. And then it gets to the server. So that's pretty cool. So you can like double filtered. But also, if you've got anything here attached to the switch, you are not going to be able to filter that traffic. Because if it's going straight from the switch to the server, uh, it's not going to get a chance to get filtered by the router. So just keep that in mind uh, if you're doing your QoS. Uh, this should look pretty cool compared to the other one. I mean, in my in my uh, report, uh, I said that um, quality, uh, what did I say? Uh, uh, priority queuing was one of the best ones, especially if you set it, um, set it as the highest one. It gets uh, the best QoS differences here. So, boop, 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 hit that button. All right, so here's our results. Let's go, we just use this one. All right, now, that's peaking at like 0 0.025. Let's just say 0 0.025. Let's compare that to our FIFU. All right, stack, overlay that. So you can tell like, just because it's of the high priority it goes straight through. It's going from the gamers to the server in like less than like less than 0 0.05 seconds. That's amazing, right? And then this is the first in, first out. And keep in mind the first in, first out was even better than the other one. 
So this is without any QoS. Then it's the blue one, which is um, first in, first out. And then you got priority queuing. Look how it dropped that uh, that delay. So I mean, we weren't even close to here. We were close to like half a second. Here we're less than half a second, and here we're not even reaching one tenth of a second. So that is really good. That's like really fast, really snappy game. All right. So that's how you do QoS, guys. And um, uh, if you w one more thing, I want to just quickly say if, if I show you guys here. Boop, 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 boop. All right. If you if you so if I choose priority queuing again, but I choose, I don't know why it's doing this, but if I choose, so that was TOS that I did. If I immediately change it to protocol and then run the test again, I haven't set up protocol on this. So if I show you what I'm talking about here, so if we go QoS again, uh, priority queuing, and instead of opening TOS based, we're looking at protocol based. So let's make, let's check that out. Let's make it a little bigger. Shizer, okay. So profile, blah, 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 details. All right, so look, yeah, there's different rows as well. So we want to go to the highest row. So let's see, classification scheme, unassigned. Okay, so look here. So this protocol-based app is saying that ICMP, I, I don't know what protocol that is, but apparently it's very important. It gets top-rated um, stuff. Whereas if we look at the medium one, let's see what the medium one's got here. The medium one says UDP traffic is then filtered next. And then let's look at the normal traffic. Normal traffic is TCP. So, and we're using TCP with our database. So if you do it by protocol and you don't change the thing here, you're only going to get like, you're going to go from zero to one. Like that's the difference in, in, in categories you're going to be jumping. The classification of your traffic is going to go up only a little bit. Whereas if you go all the way here to high, oops, you can either change it here. Uh, so if we say, oh, it's already, okay, if we say TCP is here, then it will say, okay, if you run the protocol, um, TO, uh, protocol profile, then TCP will have uh, the highest rating. And then you hit okay. And then when you run it, um, all TCP traffic on your network will have the highest rating. So that should help you guys with QoS. Um, another thing I've seen, just the last last thing here, sorry. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Okay, so if you're trying to compare stuff, right? Because comparing stuff can be quite weird sometimes. Uh, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Uh, if I compare what I've actually got here. So let me do this one. And 50 users. All right, okay, mm, probably not the best. But uh, what I'm trying to say is, you don't have to always show the graph like this, right? You can go here as is, and you can change it all kinds of things. So I think average is the only one that I actually understand. Uh, I don't even understand this, I'm not gonna lie to you. But it just looks a little bit better when you're comparing two separate traffic, uh, like especially a high versus low, um, if you do it like this, and then you like, you can take a picture of this and be like, oh, look at that. So as you can see, my one traffic, uh-oh, what have I done? Oh, no. Let me back into that. Yeah, I should not have chosen average. Okay, hold on. If I go back as is, okay, I'll try this again. I want to see what it looks like now, so. Um, but yeah, you don't have to show your graph like that. You can zoom in, do all kinds of stuff. Oh, it's just flatlined. Is there even traffic there? I think it might be, it just might be really tiny. Let me just double check. Oh yeah, okay, there is traffic, it's just really tiny. Look, it, does, it, it peaks at uh, 0 0.025. Uh, so that is 25 ms. Uh, that is a very small amount of ms. Anyway, uh, change how the graph looks, make it beautiful, try your best, get a really cool uh, thing, and write about it in the report. All right. I wish you guys luck. Au revoir.